No, I wasn't particularly looking for that. I was <laughs> looking for work, is what I was looking for. Um, but yeah, I think, see, when I, f I first came to Los Angeles about like 12 years ago or something, and I think very much when I, when I arrived here, it was very much like, no, if you want to do films, you don't do TV, so you know, keep away from that. And that, over the last 10 years, has completely changed. Um, and now I, th I think quite a healthy thing that happened maybe over the last couple of years as well is because there was starting to become an attitude of, oh, all the film people are coming and doing television now. Oh, aren't we lucky that the film <laughs> people are coming? And I think that has changed as well in a very healthy way, that just because you, you couldn't be successful in one medium doesn't in any way mean that you're kind of somehow slightly slumming it to come and, you know, deign to do television. Um, now I think it's very clear that just because you've done well in one medium doesn't mean you're going to do well in another medium, even though obviously they're related, they're both camera-based things, you know, they're very different. So I think that's a good thing that the television itself is being explored as a, as a medium in its own right um, and as distinct from film. Um, so I, I was aware that, you know, the best kind of storytelling that was going on um, was happening in TV. Uh, I think, you know, the fact that, the, that you can tell a story over maybe 12 hours of one season really opens the door for, as an actor, to, to explore character in a different way, to explore story in a different way. Um, and because of the subject, I suppose it was a coming together of lots of things, where you've got, you know, things like Showtime and HBO and, you know, channels that are really pushing the boundaries of what the subject matter can be and how you can tell it, and then a, a sort of a strata of, of filmmaking that's not happening in film anymore. Um, a certain kind of budget, a certain kind of subject matter that has just started being told on television instead. And so the actors who are interested in that kind of work, you know, but you just inevitably drift into working on TV. It was a combination of a lot of things. I, I think on one level it was proving to myself that I could do more than one thing, uh, which I was not convinced of, honestly. I, I think as a, a for me as an actress, I was leaning towards more comedic roles because I thought that's all I was ever going to get. And I, I love doing comedy, I'll never stop doing that. But that's not necessarily what I sought out to do as an actress. I wanted to do everything as an actress. And those doors were not closed, but seemingly kind of almost closed. And so going after this job, it was, it was proving a lot of stuff to myself. And John Madden, who directed our pilot, who really championed me, and, and as well as these two lovely ladies, um, I, I think they, all three of you guys, saw me in this role well before I saw myself in the role. And my audition with, with John Madden was three hours long and full hair and makeup, and we basically read the entire script. And I remember walking away from that audition thinking, that is the best audition I have ever had, and I am never getting that part. <laughs>